Hey yo, what's poppin'? Party people, I'm that one dude, Christian Music, and welcome back to Slay the Spire. You already know what time it is. It's been 10 days since the last time we played. That's like two months in internet history, in internet time. So I think it's about time that we had another Slay the Spire video. And this time I want to do things a little bit different. I'm feeling confident today. I think that with the way that the last video went, completing the spire as the defect, starting the spire as the watcher and getting past act one i'm confident that i can get through acts two and three in this video and if i don't you guys don't get anything out of it but i will try the other characters so what i want to do is if i die as the watcher i'm then gonna start playing as the ironclad and see how far i can make it as the ironclad if i die as the ironclad i will then move on to the silent after the silent the watcher and i just want to see how far i can make it with these characters as i'm learning all three of them at the same time i feel like sticking to one run for a, char a specific character you know that was like getting the feel for the game itself but now that we have a feel for the game it's time to get a little crazy <laughs> let's get into it i also don't really there I go with the voice cracks again. I also don't really plan on showing too much of what I'm doing unless something insanely crazy happens because you know, the last four or five videos of this, you guys have been watching me play just about every card, but this is a new character. So I don't know if I get a new card and I like the way that I'll figure it out. Don't even worry about it. Somebody in the comments of my last video was also telling me not to be afraid to go into wrath. Here's my problem with wrath. I do and receive double damage. That's a problem because if you notice, my health is already at 57 out of 79. This guy is going to do 17 damage to me. If I enter Wrath, that leaves me with one, uh, one energy. I guess I could use this. That's a lot of damage. If I don't block this, if I don't block that attack and I take double that, that's a lot of damage. No, that's a lot of damage. So I feel like entering wrath is never really the best choice unless you are absolutely prepared. But I'm being bold today. I'm confident. I'm confident as shit. You know, I'm, I'm angry. No, oh, he's going to do 34. I may have made a mistake. I may be in danger. I'm in danger. Oh, that hurt a lot. Okay, so receiving double damage isn't exactly what I thought it was. That's fine. Not getting away with my money, bitch. Neither are you. Give it back. Another thing, another tip was that I don't have to take any of these cards. I can always skip because having more cards doesn't necessarily mean a better build. Having less cards is actually a better idea, which is why you guys are telling me to get rid of my basic blocks and my basic attacks because they don't really do as much as some of these newer ones would do and it takes a little longer for me to shuffle through my cards to get the good ones if i have all the bad ones still in there so again great tips stuff that i wish i had known or paid more attention to in the beginning with that being said i'm gonna take this meditate card i know i didn't have to but it was a good one it looked like a good card okay so let's do some card removal then because if i should be getting rid of my basic attacks Okay, you can only card remove one time. That's kind of ass. All right, come at me! I've only got 20 HP, but fuck it, we ball! Why does everything have to attack for so much? <laughs> like, why? Why? Yeah, I'm dead. Well, that was fun. That was fun. So much fun. Oh! You know, I wanted to do that. 
that was all part of the plan because now we get to play as the ironclad once again it's been it's been since the first episode that we got to play the ironclad now we're, we're we've come full circle there's absolutely nothing wrong with oh max hp at eight fuck you yeah. all right ironclad show me what you got deal eight damage that's pretty good that's pretty good. Get that out of here, just cuz. I so miss getting licked. Okay. All right. The Ironclad's got some kick to him. Costs one less energy for each time you lose HP this combat. Deal eight. Is this what I've been missing out on? Deal nine damage. I kind of like this one. Cause then it's like, it's incentive. It's a high risk, high reward. It's incentive to take damage because it takes off like one energy or one cost, but you deal hit. Yes. I feel like I have to. You duck into a small hut, uh, upgrade a card. Yes. I didn't even have to think about that. We're kind of just speeding through, you know? At this point, it's a speed run. I'm feeling so confident that... Fuck! Damn it! Ah, I should have paid more attention. This is what happens when I get too excited. It is not even that big of a deal. Because honestly... Fuck. <laughs> honestly... Speed running strat is the way to go. Look at that. That was 22 unnecessary damage that I did to him. Deal 12 damage can be upgraded any number of times. This gets an infinite upgrade. I feel like I have to take that one. That would be like a golden card right there. Damn. Ugh. Upgrade all cards in the hand for the rest of the combat. I'm gonna save that. Okay, so I took six damage. So that means uh, I thought this card was gonna cost zero. Yo, low key though, I'm having more fun just like breezing through the game. Oh shit. Boom! Oh! Oh! Deal damage equal to your block. Gain five block, deal five damage, draw one card, put a hand, put a card from your hand on top. Okay. Ooh, I'm feeling so confident that I could defeat an elite, but I want to see what that upgrade does for my... Okay, there's an elite here, so I'm just going to go to the rest spot, take on this monster, take on the elite, progress from there. The Ironclad is OP. <laughs> I know I said that about the defect, but I think this time you'll 16 damage. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. No. Because why'd they do it to him? Why'd they have to give me such a powerful card? I could easily take out one of these. And then just take the four damage. Am I, I am I enjoying the ironclad more than the defect? Now I have to wonder how did I possibly lose the first time playing this game as the ironclad? Cuz I don't think there's any way that anybody should be losing. Probably shit like this. That's that's probably shit like this is why I lost. Now I don't feel so confident to fight the elite. But 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 Bob, you're dead now. Yeah, if I play it smart, oh, if I play it smart, the Ironclad might be might be able to rival my love for the defect. Deal five damage twice. At the end of your turn, gain three block. Add a random attack into your hand. It costs zero. I like both of these cards, so I'm gonna do a little.
All right, that's the one we're going for. Uh, okay. I'm gonna go to the rest spot, heal myself up, and then go to the elite from there. That way, I'm still taking on an elite, but I have health now. Oh, light work! Light work! All right, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna pop the blessing of the forge. Drink that. All right, and then I'm gonna use a dexterity potion. Deal damage to you. And then deal damage to you. Get that 19 block. So those cards that I just discarded ha are still upgraded because it was an upgrade for the rest of the game or the rest of the battle. Whatever. They're throwing all these days cards in my hand and I don't like it. Not a fan of it. I didn't ask for this. See, look at that. That's ridiculous. That's one. Here we go. Ah! Oh! Strawberry. Pawn pickup razor max HP to seven. <laughs> Nothing's killing me now. Nothing can kill somebody with 95 HP. Oh, I like fighting these things because they're super weak. And I deal a lot of damage. Like that. That was a sick ass play right there. I like that. Only take one H one damage? That was a sick ass play. <laughs> oh! Gain five block, upgrade a card in your hand for the rest of the combat. That's a good deal. And none of the so far, none of the Ironclad's cards have cost all that much. I want to take that. Okay, okay. All right. Yeah! Yeah! And then I'm gonna end my turn. Oh wait, no. Wait, yes, yes. No, I'm not gonna do that. Because I don't have any energy, so it's not gonna do any damage. Yeah, yeah, use your sharp hide all you want. I'm not gonna attack you, I know better than that. Look at all that damage I've done so far. I love this. Got him down to 82. Got him down to 82 health. He might get me though. That's okay. Not even a, not even a big deal. Not a big deal at all. You know what, I'll take that damage. I'll take the damage if it means killing him a lot faster. Cause he's he's done now. I just need to hit him with one more heavy hitter. Like this. And he's done. Oh! Yes! Deal 32 damage! Yeah. Pump pick up, remove two cards from your hand during boss and leave us in his start. Doubles the effectiveness. Yeah. 
Yeah. Since you guys were telling me to get rid of my basic attack and block cards, I'm taking your word for it. I'm listening to you. Yeah. That card feels like such a no-brainer. 32 damage? Imagine when I get to upgrading it. How much damage is it going to let me do then? Well, speak of the devil. Speak of the devil. 42. <sighs> but then I've still got this card right here. Upgrade all cards in your hand. Oh, decisions, man. It's not like I can't come back or not like I can't upgrade my cards again in the future, but it's what do I need right now, you know? Merchant man, I've got money. Start each combat with 10 block. You know what? Yes, I'm gonna. I'm absolutely gonna take that. <laughs> absolutely. Thank you for that. Thank you for that. You are actually doing me a favor. Confusion never fails. <laughs> Let's see what this elite is talking about. Okay, all right, all right, let's calm down now. Let's take it easy, all right? There's no need to get hostile right now. Six times six? That's gotta be a joke. You're joking, right? That, that's a joke, right? That's not a joke! That's not a joke! Fuck! <laughs> well, let's see what the silent is all about. Let's see with my newfound knowledge of Slay the Spire, how far I can make it with the silent. Because that's what we're all here for, right? That was stupid. I got rid of two additional cards just to double the effectiveness of my potions. But watch that be the one thing that saves me. <laughs> that was a good play. That was smart. Alright, our first elite as the silent. I got some pretty decent cards uh, it, off screen. I was I was kind of having a little bit of fun. I didn't say much, so I probably won't show it. This is kind of light work. I say that until I get to act two and then I start getting dogged on by all the enemies that I encounter or I start making stupid decisions. Oh, come on. Don't do this to me. 
Uh, it's literally one. Get that shit out of here, man. What did I get? Gained 300 gold. What does that do for me now? What does that do for my health? All right, Mansion Man, what do you got for me and my 527 gold? Add three shivs into your hand. That's a pretty decent card, and it's on sale. Deal four damage to all enemies twice. That's a pretty good card. Let's do a card removal. Uh... Yep. Let's get... Let's get this. That way I can still use my... Uh... That way I can still go to my question mark rooms. Uh, let's get this one. This and that. No, no space. Uh, 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 uh. Yell at me about it in the comments. There's gotta be at least one time that I tell you guys to yell at me about it in the comments in a video. We have made it to Act 1 boss. This is Act 1, right? Yeah, this is, I, I'm pretty sure this is Act 1. I don't feel confident at all. Let me get a big stretch in. Oh! I took down these two with no problem. Again, I didn't say much. At this point, we're kind of just speeding through it. I don't want to show you guys too much, and then the boss fights are what are important. So, with that being said, let's get some intense dabblage going on here. Yeah, spawn your little flames. Six times. What the fuck kind of shit is this? Off rip though is insane! Off rip! Why? I probably should have used my uh, my block potion, but I wasn't even thinking about it. We're not doing too bad anymore. After after taking that one big hit, I haven't really gotten hit that bad since. So major setback, minor setback for major comeback. Not too terrible. And these shivs have been doing wonders, let me tell you. That burn card kind of fucked me over. But it's okay. It's okay. We should be done now. Oh, I keep getting through Act 1 with all the characters, but then as soon as I get to Act 2, everything falls apart. Next turn, draw X cards and gain X energy. So let's say that I have all three of my energy points. I use this card, gain three cards, and then gain that energy right back? That's a no-brainer. I feel like, whatever. At the start of your turn, there's addition of cards. Start each combat confused. Okay, I'm gonna leave it here. We're gonna pick this up in the next video. Act two as the silent. We started act two as the watcher, now it's act two as the silent. I, this is kind of messy, it's all over the place. I don't really know how to structure the videos anymore because playing as the defect, I was doing one act or like getting to the boss of one act per video. But now that I'm playing three different characters and trying to see how far I can get, it's like, it's kind of getting harder for me to show what I'm doing in the video because a lot of it is just me sitting here applying the cards and like playing the game. I feel like I'm getting, or I feel like I've gotten a very great hand on the game. So I know what I'm doing and I don't really need to be like, okay, so what does this do? So if I do this, then this will happen. I'm, I'm literally just sitting here clicking away, not really commentating much. 
But I don't know. You guys let me know for yourselves what you thought of, you know, the way that I edited this video down. I don't know how long it's going to be because I've actually been recording for longer than I usually do for these videos. So I guess we'll see. If you want to see my last video of Ravenous Devils, I'll have that link somewhere around here. And if you want to see the last Slay the Spire video where we actually got through the Spire as the defect, I'll also have that link somewhere around here as well. I'm going to get out of here. I love you guys. I love you guys. Stay safe out there, take it easy, and big body out! I forgot to mention I was wearing my Demon Slayer shirt because we're slaying demons and monsters. We're slaying the spire. I'm gone.